Hi, this is the Daily Horoscope for my water signs, Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces for June 20th, 2024. Hello, my fabulous water signs. Show your love and support. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share. On my YouTube channel, I posted up um, a video talking about the full moon events that are going to happen and how it's going to affect each sign, so be sure to check that out. Also, my weekly horoscopes are up of based on the astrology. Tonight I'll be doing just terascopes. So my fabulous crabs, the moon and Sagittarius today forming a fire trine. This is a beautiful time for business picking up. For some of you, you could appreciate the change of pace happening in your routine. I feel like you can be working overtime today. You can be bubbly, happy, and optimistic with this energy. Coworkers may expand co-workers those friendships may expand beyond the workplace and you could be hanging out with them and having drinks with them after work or having dinner with them after work or making plans for the weekend to hang out with them i feel for some of you here um your health can be improving at this time if you've been sick like me you, this is a great time for your health to improve yay us scorpio let me see. This is a good time for business picking up. You can be losing things today, or you could be forgetful, so expect to lose your cell phone, your keys. Mm, okay. Um, you can find yourself more out and about. This can be you making a point to go visit and hang out with friends. For some of you, you may not be getting along with the women in your life, and you may not be on speaking terms with mother or sister or aunties that kind of thing. This could be friends who are like family to you, you may not be on speaking terms with as well. Not the easiest time for love relationships. You could be wanting to see other people. Um, Pisces, let me see. Okay, Pisces, the moon in Sagittarius today. This is a great time for business picking up. This could also be career growth happening, getting a job, raise or promotion, recognition, and success in regards to career. Also, we have a mutable square happening, so this could be tantrums and tiaras being thrown for some of you, making impulsive decisions at this time. You may have no patience for other people. For others of you, this is your schedule or your routine changing. You could be getting busier at work, or you could be getting busier with your business, so this could be your routine changing today and then on the 21st with the full moon with the um, planets in cancer okay so busy 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 um, for some of you, you could be also put in a leadership position changing shifts um, for some of you this is really difficult time for you that you have to overcome certain parts of your ego because you have a difficult time with change because you're scared that certain parts of your emotional or stable or financial stability is going to be taken away from you or like certain parts of your life like for ex like for example if you have kids and you're going through a divorce you're afraid that you know those relationship dynamics are going to change so you're creating all these like bad case scenarios during jupiter forming an air trine in your fourth house hello goodbye this is a time of manifesting okay bitch if you want to manifest doom and gloom be scared where you are right now because you're going to be manifesting doom and gloom where you are right now. So even though you're worried about future and stuff and the changes that you want to make, but it's happening in your current with challenges that you are manifesting. So, you know, thoughts really do become things. I would not go thinking about that. I would get excited about the changes that are happening because change is good. And we're supposed to be changing, not digressing and going backwards because nothing happens to us, okay? You could be delving more into alcohol or drugs at this time because of trying to step out of your comfort zone because your soul is restless for change at this time and you not wanting to listen to your intuition and you not wanting to listen to your soul at this time with this energy and you know that you have to make certain changes in your life but out at the same time it's you and your ego that is challenging yourself to step out of your comfort zone okay so that's why you're numbing you're dulling you're avoiding the responsibilities that you need to take at this time you're avoiding the changes that you need to take at this time because you know that this is an end of an era this is an end of a chapter and the more you you try to hold on with your claws which I talk about in the weekly horoscopes the more you are going to experience worse changes when the eclipse because the eclipse if you don't belong in a situation anymore boo boo you gonna get kicked out in a big way 
okay so you know and i can't control people and we got south node in the eighth house that deals with popo the judge the court system you know so you might get physically removed or kicked out of a place so it's up to you what you want to do with that energy you know i can lead a horse to water but i can't make that damn bitch drink okay so at this point i'm drowning horses so i don't know keep me away from your horse i might kill it okay show your love and support to your girl marie and make sure to like subscribe and share kisses Mwah.